Hi everyone, it's finally summer here in UK. We had a great weather in the past one week. It's so hot, that's the reason I sat under a nice shadow here with my dog as always, which I'm about to shoot a video regarding the DJI Mini 2. In this video, I'm about to show you how to shoot a 360 sphere panorama with your DJI Mini 2 and how to upload it to Facebook in the right way. There's few steps that you need to do before you upload it to Facebook because right now the Facebook doesn't recognize a 360 image. It recognizes the 360 panorama but not the sphere image where you could click and check the surrounding as 360. So that's what we're doing today. I will be showing you my way. So if there's a better way or an easier way than this, just comment below and let me know because I know there's few other ways including the one that you go into facebook360.com and so on let me show you my way and let's begin Now that we got the drone in there, what you're gonna do, you will make sure your gimbal is level with the horizon, which in my case it is. I will go then to my settings, check my white balance from auto manual, see if anything is overexposed or underexposed. For me, this is really good. I will be using the auto mode and not play around with mania mode. Usually you could maybe get three of them, like overexposed, underexposed and normal, and then put them together. But I will explain that on the next video, which will be how to take the best photos with your DJI Mini 2. So stay tuned for that. So let's get into the video. As soon as you are happy with the results with your white balance, go to your photo, choose your panel, sphere, and just let it do the job. After the 360 image is done, bring your drone back and we will go through a few of the other steps that you need to do before you upload it to Facebook. Look at this guys, my drone is a mosquito killer. After you landed, you need to double check the image, go to your album, find your image, go to sphere. And this is the image and if you're happy with it, then the next step is you need to download the Google Street View app, which is totally free and this will allow us to upload the 360 image to this app and from here to Facebook because if you try to go straight away to Facebook I will show you how it will look it will look like this and this is not what we want this is a 360 panorama yes but not a sphere you cannot click on it and go around so how to do that is go back to your DJI app activate your Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, press the lightning here for a quick transfer switch. So that will allow us to transfer the photo from our drone to our phone. Press the image, go on the top right to share it. Find your app that you just downloaded the Google Street View open it from here you need to press the orange button with the camera icon on the bottom right press import 360 photos find your photo import it then go to your profile and here is the image as you can see that looks really nice and what we do now is go to share share privately newsfeed Facebook and look at this guys now we got a proper 360 image that our friends can go around and see so I will be posting it on my page right now so if you want to see that also you can add me on my Facebook or on my Instagram so this is it guys for the video I hope you found it useful and easy to follow if you got any better idea or way to do that let me know in the comments below so other people can see so on the next video stay tuned because i have some cool ideas and tips to give you regarding of how to take the best photos with your dji mini 2 and how to put them together so until next time enjoy your day and see you in the next one